talked to Yuffie. She said that you could show us a way to get up top. Sure, I'd be happy to. Although, Yuffie's the one who found it. And according to her, that tanker's the quickest and easiest way into the city. Oh, we're doing the tanker this time too, nice. See that? That booth up there is the control room. So we can repurpose this ship as an elevator. Someone lowers and sends it back up, along with the others. Problem is, how are we supposed to get to the controls? High voltage? Yep. It should just say, no climbing. So we're stuck. Not with Mr. Dolphin. You wouldn't believe what he can do. Like, like when we met. See, I was out taking a swim all on my lonesome. At least I thought I was alone. But then, squeak, squeak, I hear this funny noise. That's great and all, but we're in a hurry. Hey. We're sorry, really. But we'll make sure to come back as soon as we're done. You can finish your story then. How does that sound? Okay, promise. <laughs> hmm? Never done it before? My arm, your arm, bam. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> awesome. All right, then. Now what? Now we ask Mr. Dolphin to get you up. With his help, it'll be a cinch. Okay, which one of you wants to go flying? Everybody's a good cloud. all over it, Murray. <laughs> Let me know when you're ready to go. Air for Tifa is gonna be like, yeah, we, we don't like to get our hair wet. And beer is, oh, say so they're probably gonna say beer is so uh, too heavy. Level 23, we're only level 21. Oh well. And of course, uh. Red is probably not suited for this either, so obviously it's got to be Cloud. Let's do this. Steered uh, Mr. Delphi to the beach balls. Uh, he loves to get... Um... Oh, he loves. So much uh, that gets him excited uh, to speed up. Okay, let's see how this, do how this goes. Oh shoot! Where am I supposed to go? I, can, I know I can use the dual stick controllers here, but I'm not doing that. No, no, no. Use that thumbstick! Oh gosh. Oh god, oh god. I am here! How's it going, Josh? How are you doing today, man? Uh-oh. <laughs> no, you didn't miss so much of the story. This is basically right after the demo, basically, so... You're good. Your house today working? Yeah, I've been trying to get a um, a remote job. I got one um, just recently. 
I just need to do the onboarding process in the um, in the training course before I get started. Okay, your ride's right here. The ship's not far, so you'll be there in no time. If we don't sink on the way. Oh, you're supposed to be in office? Okay. Careful. I think Bear should be sitting in the middle. You've been a huge help, Priscilla. No prob. Well, guys and girls, and, uh, dog, I'll see you later. Oh, uh, okay. Have fun. <laughs> hey, Mark, we're good to go down here. Why is it taking us down? What the heck? Okay. Meet you at the top. Oh, uh, okay. Look at this. That was Highland. Yep, it's Reno. the others so like I said before if, uh, as soon as we get Yuffie on, on board we're gonna go with, uh, t uh, go back to the green list and do the side jobs ah there you are let's move Wait, yeah, it's. I'm, I've been trying to play, uh, keep uh, play Tekken, but uh, a lot of uh, single player games, um, especially um, with this game and Reload, it's gonna be pretty tough to, <laughs> to manage that schedule. Wow. A security that I. Yes, we're gonna shot. We're gonna. Uh, Play, play, play the, uh, the main story too if uh, Yuffie joins and then we're gonna go back to the Greenland areas to do all the uh, side jobs because we are quite behind the levels on the other hand the robe men won't be easy to find they're definitely not here let's head into town we cannot let Midgar win not on our own home turf they do not know. <laughs> Any idea what that is? The highway. 
Shinra's pride and joy. The fastest, most advanced airship and fleet. Screw the boat. Let's take that. Plus you got a trained crew and piloting skills we don't know about? We're sticking with the boat. That's too bad. Would have been perfect. Hey, beggars can't be choosers. This is so cool. Oh, that's supposed to be this way? Okay. I thought it could tell us that we're not supposed to go through here. Okay. No. We'll leave them be. For now. <laughs> I know, right? Hello, Zang. An from Wutai is here. Sent by Viceroy Saru. Oh? He introduced himself as Colonel Glenn Ladbrock. I thought you were dead. <laughs> then you thought right. Let's cut to the chase, Mr. President. The Viceroy and your late father had big plans. I assume you intend to carry them out? Correct. That's good to hear. Some people just don't have the stomach for war. And this battle for the Magnus Materia demands commitment from both Wutai and Shinra. Thank you. I'm aware. But my father is dead, which changes the equation. A new vision is required. You always did prefer to march to the beat of your own drum. This new vision include your fairy tale promised land? <laughs> you Shinras, you take and you take, you never give back. Left to you, this world would end up an empty husk. War can put things right. Beget anger, desolation, hatred, and in its wake, new unity. A people rejuvenated, and a planet once more made whole. What we're doing's for the greater good. Just gotta know when to ease off the gas. Now listen. You started this, remember? No more playing the idle air. You have obligations to fulfill. <laughs> Let's give the people what they deserve. Oh, right. Before I leave, a message from the Viceroy. Congratulations on your inauguration, Mr. President. Shinra has a bright future. <laughs> hmm. Interesting to see how this goes. Remember, a 
You represent Juno. It's our sworn duty to keep the president safe. Got her in that flow step. I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> Don't just mind me, we're just strolling through. Yeah, we totally blend in. What can you tell us about Juno? It's a key military outpost with its own offshore reactor. A critical line of defense against any seaborne assault. When needed, it can transform into an armed fortress. Its strategic location, along with its air and seaports, make it second only to Midgar as the company's most vital city. Huh, neat. Any good restaurants? Sights to see? Uh... Maybe. I don't know. Ah, uh, right. You're not the touristy type. Hey, just to be clear, you do realize we're not here on vacation, right? Uh, of course I do. Hey, look, what's that about? Listen up. Midgard's second infantry will return home with the president's commendation. Let's show him how a real drill team does it and make our city proud. <laughs> Troopers, you're all off duty until the parade begins. I can't wait to do this part. The um, the marching. Those troopers seemed pretty psyched for the parade, huh? More like eager to prance around for their new paymaster. <laughs> now, I know what y'all gonna say, but I gotta ask. What? If Rufus is in town, are we really gonna let this opportunity pass us by? Hmm. Hell, I'm not saying we kill the man. But we ought to at least give him a talking to. Rough him up a little, maybe, you know? Actually, I'm gonna have to agree. First, the Turks say, do whatever, we're not after you. But then, Cloud's biker buddy rolls up and says he is. We gotta straighten this out. Okay, but how? We can't just walk up to the president in the street. Maybe we can. Huh? We bust up his parade! No. That's how we die in a hail of bullets like a bunch of dumbasses. The city's crawling with Shinra troopers. We join the parade. Hide in plain sight. Get in, get close, get answers. Seriously? Sure. Wow, that's good. No arguments here. Barrett, Fred. You guys find a route to the port. See what security's like. Earlier talking about beating up the president in the middle of the base, yep. Now hold up. Fatigues won't be enough to disguise you two. True enough. Shut up. Alright, see you in a bit. I gotta go find a uniform. Oh, we're coming with. I'm so pumped for this. This way? Yeah. He's like, oh gosh, why you two? <laughs> Attention all troopers. Spare uniforms can be found here. Please get changed. I like how she just assumed. Soon. Soon. Now we're talking. Actually, kind of cool. Well, ready to suit up? Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> what? Whoa Cloud there. Three steps back, if you please. I was about to say, Cloud, give us some privacy. You know, let's, let's be funny. Ha <laughs> ha, very funny. 
Alright. Not the feet. <laughs> In a while. Yeah, Cloud actually worn one of these before. He was actually one of them. Oh my gosh. <laughs> He's just gonna play along with it. Well Well You got me. <laughs> I'd say we left the part. Maybe. But don't forget, you gotta act the part too. Just do what I do, alright? Head to Starboard Junon when you're ready. Better hurry. You don't want to be the reason your team is disqualified. Yeah, we're gonna be in the Marshy Parade contest. Hold it! to assume that you simply forgot sorry sir sorry sir oh my god i can't i should have get that should i get it gave it away any idea how important today's ceremony is do you maggot form check now you will give your commander a flawless performance and if you show her anything less than perfect Perfection. I'll feed your ass to a behemoth! Now what? Just follow my lead. I still remember the basics. I'm having second thoughts, you guys. What the hell are you doing over there? The commander is waiting! Sir! Attention! Have to hand it to you three. You've got guts skipping out on practice. That, or you're idiots. Let's find out, shall we? I'm not about to take any chances today. I'm warning you now, though. One slip up, and I'll chuck you straight into a Marlboro's mouth. Clear? Oof. Okay, so we gotta practice a little march. Right down is tap the button. Repeatedly tap the button. Hold the button. Okay. They've been doing this forever, like it's uh they're so experienced with it. And they never done this before. Unless those guns are extremely light, it's definitely not gonna be easy. Time. 
I must say. You've impressed me. <clears throat> You'd serve as a sterling example to the others, ma'am. Congratulations! You are hereby promoted to Parade Captain of Midgar's 7th Infantry. You will be our model trooper, the one to march at the head of our drill team. Which means that our performance, satisfactory or otherwise, is now your responsibility. Ma'am! He just slaps it on. <laughs> As parade, Captain, Commander sounds like Anna. You will recall that to march in the parade, each drill team is required to muster five units or more. Look for the seventh for songs. They'll identify the best from the rest. Once assembled, you and the team will report to Starboard Junok. Tardiness will not be tolerated. Now, make us proud. Bam! Bam. All right, time to recruit some folks then. All right. Approve the rating, okay. The question is, Boy, how we're gonna be able to tell? Hey, you sure about this? Is the parade really gonna get us to Rufus? The parade won't, but the presidential commendation will. That's how these things go. The president himself gives the award. Wow, that's some plan. I mean, it's risky, but gotta go big or go home, right? <laughs> All right. Or just wearing a uniform. <laughs> it's gonna be pretty easy to tell. Yeah, speaking of the devil. Yeah, look what. We're trying to enjoy the view. It's the captain. Oh, um, uh, 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 captain. Get your shit together. Parade's about to begin. Everyone. Follow me. Yes, sir! Oh my gosh. All right. Everybody ready? Not yet. Ooh, perfect timing, Captain. Would you mind taking the picture so I can get in there? Whenever you're ready, sir. Thanks a bunch. Wow, Captain! Who knew you were such a pro? I might just have to frame this. Break time's over, people. The parade's about to begin. Follow me. Yes, yes sir! Just because we got a freaking red stripe on our helmet. <laughs> that's, that's funny. Hey, it's Barrett. Oh my god, he has a hook. <laughs> hey there. Uh, I was just checking my uniform. Uh, for Lynn. <laughs> Y'all know how it is. <laughs> he doesn't recognize him? Uh -huh, very funny. I could have shot you. You look... What? Wow. <laughs> it's not like I had a choice. Nothing else fit. Okay, I get it. Anyway, I checked out the way to the port. And y'all, uh, 
Look like you're fitting in. Yeah. Nobody's bad at an eye. We're gonna win the president's commendation. <laughs> I'm sure you will. Think you mean I'm rooting for you. Ready to move when you are, sir! Sir! We only got two units, man. We're the we're not ready yet. We're definitely not we're close. They've got everything. Shame I can't take this baby home. But you know, the smaller ones are real beauty too. Hmm? Well, let me guess. You're here for the limited model too? Check the helmet, you dipshit. Oh, Captain! Please forgive me, sir! Break time's over. Outside. Now. Right away, right away sir! Do you think a can of that size? Come here, boy. Want a treat? Nice uniforms. Aw, how'd you know it was us? By your scent. That is some nose you've got there, Red. Leaving the Mako soaked streets of Midgar behind has done wonders for my faculties. Though this place is starting to take its toll. Well, he is a lion, so that makes sense. <laughs> he was like, okay, bro, I even haven't found half the team yet. What the heck are they? Oh, it's rude. What the heck? Very fishy. Kind of, yeah. Rude dude, this is so funny. He's like, Oh my god, they're rubbing their bald heads. Oh my god. <laughs> Have hairs. Over, people. Seven outside. Sir, right away, sir. So you have to be bald to be here, really? But before we let you go, uh, excuse me, but we're in the middle of an interview. Oh. Good day, Captain. You're their captain! This is perfect! If you have a moment, I'd love to ask you some questions about the parade. Uh, sorry, but... How do you plan to set your team apart from the competition? Are there any special routines you've been practicing? We, uh... <sighs> right! I see what you mean, Captain! We can't go spilling our secrets to anyone who asks, especially on camera! Break Just watch us. Over, people. The parade's about to begin. Follow me. Sir! Sing the world, maybe? Done. Kid's got a lot to... Not now, buddy. We're busy. Oh! Captain, I didn't realize! Sorry, sir! Practice is over. Time for the real deal. With me. Yes, yes sir! All right, finally, we got all ten minions. <laughs> Took me a while to get them. Seventh assembled. All set, then. Let's do this. Midgar, seventh infantry. 
Sentry, attention! I like how close <laughs> Chief and Air but are just like wingmen. Listen they're up. just there. As we march, the eyes of the whole world will be watching us. And we We cannot, we will not, let our great city of Midgar down. Failure is not an option. It's a big ask, but we can do it, together. Because we have our captain to guide us. Look to him, trust in him, and he will lead us to victory, so long as we follow. Isn't that right, sir? Uh, right. <laughs> bring it home. Today is our day. It was made for the Seventh Infantry. We will win that commendation for our city. And we will return home as champions. Yes, sir. Who's going to show the rest of them how it's done? We are. I can't hear you! <laughs> right in his face. Captain, the parade's about to start. Don't want to be late, sir. Of course. When did we last use her? Five years ago, sir. Let's blow off the dust. But, but, sir. Even a ceremonial display would constitute a violation of the ceasefire. Wutai would view it as a willful act of aggression. And? It's a new era. Let's ring it in with a bang. <laughs> Very good, sir. Very good. Nothing like fireworks to rouse the spirits. Mr. President, it's time. It's parade time, it is. Yeah. Woof, look at this. This place is beautiful. Welcome to the celebration of the century. As you can see, the streets of Junon are abuzz with excitement. People have turned out in droves to catch a glimpse of the new president, Rufus Shinra. And here comes Midgar's mobile unit. Their incredible skills are truly a sight to behold. That's a nice car though, I'm not gonna lie. There he is, folks. Rufus Shinra. Wow! Can you even hear me over this crowd? Uh, the president has stopped. Ready to fire, sir. Welcome to the New World Order. Fire! Sheesh. What are they shot at? Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, it's just a water. With thing. a single blast of Junon's famous cannon, Rufus Shinra has announced his arrival. <sighs> what a big splash that was.
Join us in Starboard Junon as the final team of the day takes their position. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Midgar 7th Infantry. The captain and his team have trained long and hard, determined to win the presidential commendation for everyone back home in Midgar. I can't wait to see what kind of performance they'll put on today. Troopers of the 7th Infantry make us proud. Left, face. Formation, change. They're doing quite well. Ah, oh, no shoot. I... Crap. I messed that up. They don't seem what? I can't... I couldn't see the freaking symbol. Begin. What? That's not bad at all. Oh my gosh. The angle is so weird. Oh my god, this timing is so weird. Not in step. Oh my gosh. That concludes the first part oh of my gosh. By the 7th Infantry Drill Team. Our judges are currently tabulating the votes from you, the viewers. And here they are now. Oh. The seventh is off to a solid start, but can they build on this beginning? Let's see what they do next. Drill team, halt! First sequence, begin! What? Oh, I gotta hold it. Crap! Oh, I'm messing up so bad. Your name was not kidding, it was hard. Such excellent direction. Should have practiced. You're watching history in the making, folks. Practice makes Final perfect. sequence. Begin. I can't take my eyes off them. Okay, that was definitely much better. And with that, the Seventh Infantry concludes the second part of their performance. As ever, our judges have been busy tallying all the votes we've received. So let's take a look at the results. Universal acclaim, and little wonder given the skill and coordination on display. Keep this up in the Seventh Oh, <laughs> this is <laughs> Oh, that first one is definitely a train wreck. Uh, okay, of course can't do a um, do over. So far, so good. What a performance! Whatever, Sarah. Their movements are so crisp and clean. That practice is paying off. Drill team. Oh, what a god, my god, that's fast. Solid work. They did practice, right? Final sequence. Begin. They've still got a chance. It all looks so effortless. All right. They're in perfect sync. Oh. Yeah, I should have done a practice round before this. That was 
terrible. Yes, sir. Around the clock. They remain unaware. Leave them to me. I want you and your people tracking the ropes. Understood. Oh, well, they figured it out. Yeah, can we get a do-over on that one? <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that was oh that was embarrassing. you on a stirring performance you've done your company proud your passion and patriotism is beyond question and i know our president can't wait to thank you all <clears throat> of course some among you are deserving of special praise for our first award, we will recognize the division whose exemplary display eclipsed all others. The prize for outstanding performance goes to... Midgar's mobile unit! Huzzah! Damn! Dang it! Oh my gosh. No, not the signature on the screen. To them and to you all, I say this. The Shinra Electric Power Company will endure. The challenges we face can be overcome if we summon our courage and cut ties with the past. Yesterday is behind us. We must look instead to the promise of tomorrow, for today is a new day. And the first of a long, arduous journey which we must take together. Follow me, and we will reach our promised land. This I do solemnly swear before you all, as president of the Shinra Electric Power Company. My friends, place your trust in me, and together will we achieve our dream of a better world.
man. All because of that bad first um, first days of this performance. Oh man, that's terrible. The award goes to Midgar's Seventh Infantry. Wait, what? Yes, we actually got it. <laughs> I think we do. <laughs> it's a tiny little stuff. <laughs> to accept this award on behalf of the team. Three of the best will now join me. Come on up. Oh, I think they're, they're suspecting something already. The president has invited three members of the 7th Infantry to come and accept the award on the drill team's behalf. Salute! Your performance today was nothing short of incredible. Midgar's 7th Infantry is, without a doubt, the pride of our people. Congratulations. I have a few private words to say to these troopers. Cut the feed. Sir! You yep, he knows. That ain't right. Excuse me. Need to get through. Barrett, over there. What's that, Yuffie? Oh my gosh. Of all the times. <laughs> I rarely talk to the rank and file. Why not take off your helmet? Cloud Strife. Uh oh. Busted. That was a first class performance. One worthy of a soldier. Stand down. But, sir! Bro, has nobody's gonna you notice what Yuffie's doing right now? Wait, nobody's gonna say anything about that? Your file was as gripping as it was enlightening. Which is why I have a proposition for you. At present, Midgar requires my full and undivided attention. The city is Shinra's beating heart. Its devastation is a humiliation, and the world must see us rebuild. To that end, I need to refocus my efforts and push certain duties to one side. Get to the point. My father left me a mountain of unfinished tasks, like the recapture of a fugitive of ancient descent. The recovery of a stolen lab specimen. And of course, the arrest and execution of Avalanche. None of which, frankly, are of any interest to me whatsoever. I'd gladly wash my hands of it all. So what? You're gonna let us go? Just like that? Yes. Really? Why did you keep your distance from Midgar, that is? No more stirring the proverbial pot. And the same goes for me? But why? Because I have a new vision for Shinra. So we go free. And you get... Sephiroth, dead. 
Oh, okay. He's an unsavory relic of our past. And I want him gone. But in our current state, so he knows that Rock killed him, not us. To get okay. the job done. So I turn to you. It's a deal. You have a lead, I take it. The guys in black robes. Clever you. You know who they are, don't you? According to Hojo, they're connected to Sephiroth. Shadows of the Man, I believe he called them. Follow them and you'll find him. Right. Go!